Uh, Tibet Innovations, an innovations development company, has developed a software, MVID Code, for accurate identification for embryologists in IVF laboratories. Now, the software, among other things, brings on board confidentiality and address the incidence of mismatch in IVF centers. Worldwide, new innovations in healthcare delivery have advanced based on various researches. The practice of in vitro fertilization IVF has come with its various challenges, making it imperative for efforts to be made to address such challenges. With the latest innovation, the issue of mismatch will be addressed. The new software multivariant identification code, MVID code, will cater for the assisted reproductive technology ART sector with focus on ART laboratories. At a program to present the software, embryologist creator of the software Babatunde Olua Shegun noted the system serves as a productive psychological influence on users and a faster identification process. The MVID code is not only about identification it could also capture data it could capture accounting records and medical history nurses management embryology overview andrology records and so many more so and we even have plans in the future that after some successes we'll keep building more and more participants welcome this software um, from the new software I've come to see um, from Envid code I think it will help in easy identification not to mix up patients because talking about fertility i think it's a very serious thing and you don't have to mess up anything so i think deploying this software might help us i mean in in our ivf centers on the international media we've had several centers and several instances of mismatches as in a sperm from a different man being mixed up with the eggs of a different woman um, but like was said in our local setting there is a possibility that this may happen but we do not know of them. But to be able to curtail this in our local settings, as in Accra or Ghana, um, that's one of the advantages that this software stands to, uh, to serve. The software is yet to be on the market.